This is the Mercedes-Benz AVTR. Get it? AV Avatar? Huh? AVTR concept vehicle. Now, it's called the Advanced Vision Transportation, but we all know it's just it's just Avatar. And this vehicle is part of Mercedes-Benz plan for a more sustainable future. Now, that ties in very well with James Cameron's Avatar and its upcoming sequel. In fact, James Cameron was here and he talked about sustainability and how he's all about that now. Well, Mercedes-Benz is all about that and so they got together and they made this. A crazy looking concept car. The AVTR, Avatar? I was just call it the Avatar. The AVTR is all about sustainability. Everything about this concept is about eco-friendliness. The car is supposed to be carbon neutral. It's going to be electric. It's supposed to really interact with the outside world. In fact, even merge with it. Even when the doors are open, it sort of looks like a dragonfly. The back of the car has these 33 individual hatches that sort of resemble the scales on a reptile. Now, those are supposed to be used to communicate with the outside world and communicate with the driver. I'm not sure how the driver would know what's going on back there, but they're there. But it's more than just an odd, but cool exterior. When you drive the car, it's unlike anything else you've ever driven, if this ever comes to production, which it won't. There's no steering wheel. In fact, you get in the car and using biometrics, the car merges with the driver. Yeah. <laughs> and then you drive like that. When you want to use the infotainment system, you just sort of wave your hand and the infotainment system controls appear on your hand. I guess you touch them and then you make gestures and that's how you do everything. You don't kind of touch anything because you are one with the car. It's supposed to be a symbiotic relationship, which is kind of creepy, but at the same time, very future looking and cool. And while this car does have some wild designs and crazy ideas, it does sort of follow the EQ design aesthetic as it has the lines, the seats, of course it has the big Mercedes-Benz logo on the front. But it's not just about crazy design. The way the car drives is also unique. It'll drive forward and back like your regular car, but it'll also go sideways. It'll crab walk via these odd wheels that are resembling the seeds from the movie. How the car is charged, I'm assuming is via an obtainium, the mineral from the movie. But of course, everything about this vehicle is about sustainability. And that's the reason why James Cameron essentially just gave his blessings to Mercedes-Benz for this vehicle. It also helps that he has an upcoming sequel to Avatar coming. So if you're looking forward to the new Avatar, well, maybe this car will show up in it. For more crazy concept vehicles from CES, be sure to subscribe to Engadget.